Hello guys, um, I know I updated my um, investment life. I show you my uh, account on how it works last December 25, 2021. And I just want to update you today. Today is January 23, uh, 2022. And um, uh, the stocks market is so low right now. It's either if you have like a lot of courage, it's good time right now to buy uh, stocks. But again, you don't know if this is well going down and down or it will go up after a month or days so that's the reason why guys it's better to do a long-term investment than a short term because you really lose a lot of money if you will do a short term so I will show you guys the update of my investment and it's all red and I'm not really like so sad because I know my retirement money will be I will withdraw my retirement money 25 years from now so I'm really not sad that my money is really down right now for the Roth IRA, the annual contribution is uh, um, 6000 so today is January 23, but I already contributed 4200 for the year 2022. So I only have 1800 left to contribute for that account because I cannot contribute more than 6000 a year. That's why I contributed a lot because uh, last week all the stocks go down so I buy it right away. Then now it's getting more 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 down. The stocks is so low right now but I only have 1,800 left. So I'm deciding if I will buy that to a Microsoft or a stock for Microsoft or I'll just put that in and expand. So I will show you guys the update as of January uh, 23, 2022. So this is my Roth IRA. So I just cover everything. I just cover it manually because I'm afraid I will show it to the public and that's for my safety. If you can see here guys, this is all red. So that I lost for my whole total retirement account, I lost 778. So that's, that's the world of investment. As of today, my contribution for my Roth that out of my pocket is 10,200 so you can look right now that is the current value right now 9,424 so I lost a lot of money as of January 23, 2022 and this is for my Roth 401k I lost a lot of money too 875 but that is already the gain because I have a lot of gain of the Roth 401k Actually, my contribution, the money that I contributed to this account, uh, like out from my pocket, is only 7,922. So I contributed 7,922 and last uh, January 1, it is become, uh, so as of January 1, that is 12,837, I, I contributed uh, January 1700 that is my contribution and also the company because the company matched for it um, my total uh, balance right now for the Roth 401k is one thirteen thousand six hundred seventy nine. so on this account this is my three years account already three years old account so I just contributed that one again nine seven thousand nine hundred twenty two and right now is even I lost eight hundred seventy five but still uh, I gain money 13,679 so that is the difference this is a three years old account the earlier the Roth IRA is only two months old account so that is the difference if you will do uh, long-term investment in long term you really get a lot of money Hi guys, this is this video is for my um, financial update. As of uh, 2 12 2022, look guys, how bad is the stock market? That's why uh, don't ever like uh, nervous or jump like sold your stocks because you're afraid it will go down. It's like it's a part of in the stock market, guys. So it's all red right now, it means uh, losing money. So, uh, uh, look guys, I already contributed as of today in my Roth 
contribution uh, 11,100 but look how much money I have 7,259 I borrowed 3,000 for our closing uh, cost to, for because we are buying a house um, besides that uh, 3,000 I lose 855 as of today so that's my update again uh, today is February 12 2022 so I lost a lot of money on my uh, retirement account but again that's a part of the investment don't be scared that's my update today guys as of uh, February 12 2022 the stock markets is really down I lost like 800 50 something and we'll see i will update you every time so i will show you how my investment works this is the update for my roth 401k under my uh, company's um, retirement account so um on my roth i get three thousand to add on to our closing fee for our house but i never touch my uh 401k so this is my 401k at work and this is the roth 401k uh, so see so you can see guys my balance as of where is the date oh my balance as of February 12th so it's 14,206 so if you can see guys uh, my the money that um, I contributed out of my pocket or from my salary is only for the 401k is 3,964 because I stopped doing it in the end like last quarter of 2021 I changed it to the Roth my Roth 401k is 4,406 that is as of February 12 and but my total money right now is uh, 14,206 so you can see that guys I only contributed this one but that's how my money is right now because of the um uh we s i invested into the stocks and the stocks make money uh and then my company uh much that is from the much from my company as well so you are, i am making a lot of money in my 401k that is the update of my uh, investment guys for my retirement um I, uh, as of february 12 2022 um i show you guys the update and i know if you will follow or you watch my old videos uh, i just started my roth ira uh, november first week of november 2021 and and my i started my roth or 401k at work uh, maybe two years ago i am not so um like into it i just um contribute i just contribute my 401 or roth 401k because that's why i said roth 401 and 401 because i have both when i started i do 401k because i really don't understand about investment and retirement i just did it because i know my company will match it that's the reason why but i'm not really into it it's only last of uh, october end of october that i really get serious of my investment for my retirement and that's the reason why i started first week of november so when i started that one that's the time i started everything and i found out that roth 401k is better than 401k for my own opinion okay it depends on you guys still you make your own choices okay i will not um, encourage you to do roth or for the traditional it's do your own research and before you decide um again i am not a professional licensed uh, advisor i'm i'm just a pharmacy technician guys i'm a licensed pharmacy technician not a legal advisor so i show you my update because i want to encourage you guys that it's not too late to start for investing on your retirement and if you have a little you cannot afford to contribute the maximum limit for the whole year um anything that you can put on your retirement matters and it will grow and that's the reason why i sh updating you also my um my investment for you to not afraid to invest some people there's a lot of people that don't understand about investment they are afraid oh i will not put the investment because maybe the stock market will go down and i will lose my money yes there's a tendency to do that but if you are wise enough and you understand how the investment move 
and as long as for me i'm not afraid even now it's so down right now but because i know i'll put my money i will need my money on my retirement so so it will be 20 to 25 years from now so, okay so i know it will recover that's the reason why i'm showing you the movement of my investment or for me to encourage you guys that don't be afraid okay don't be afraid to do your investment but if you have plan like a like a plan to buy or to buy something or big expenses or big purchase in the near future like five years from now i think don't invest your money in a retirement because you cannot withdraw your uh, i know for the roth ira you can withdraw your contribution anytime without penalty but it's not okay to do that like i know i borrow my roth ira um because we are i added that to my closing fee to, for us to buy the house but i know that i can afford to put it back within 60 days i know that i already have money uh, set aside for that one and and from today february 12 i know i have three more or four more salaries coming so i know i can afford to put it back so that's the reason why i'm not afraid to get my um money from my roth but um the irs will only allow you to do it once a year and irs are not happy watching that you're getting out in and out from your Roth that is supposed to be your retirement that's the reason why guys I said save your emergency I know I have an emergency guys but I spent a lot bef earlier than the time that we know that we're buying a house uh, I thought we are buying a house next year but there again there is a good opportunity to buy the house so I we just get it I told my husband whatever it takes I will do my very best to get that house to be ours so that's the reason why i really that's my last um i still have again i still have money on my um uh, individual uh brokerage account but uh, the stock market is so low right now if i will withdraw that money i have three thousand in there right now if i withdraw that money i lose like a thousand so i said i better get my money in my roth because i will not lose money uh than getting my the one that is in the brokerage but i know um i already withdraw like yesterday i already sold one of my uh, one of my stocks in there so i already set aside for that one i will just that is two thousand us dollars so i will just set aside and add one thousand and then i will return my roth the money that i owe for my roth ira so again uh i show you my investment not to show off or in Tagalog, Pagyayabang, no? My channel's purpose is to inspire you guys that even me, I started with a, I started in a scratch. Like, literally, I ran away from my ex-husband without anything on me except the wedding ring and the engagement that's so expensive. But when I try to sell it, it's only 1,000 US dollars. That's why I said, jewelry is not an investment, guys. Believe me, it's not an investment okay so i have a video on that one and then yeah that's the sole purpose of my channel to inspire you guys not to show off what i have uh, i just want to show that um i started with the scratch i started i started with nothing and now i am positive net worth and we have our own house soon um hopefully we will uh, have a closing in the end of february and um, yeah so that is that's what i said guys there's a saying says if you want things there are thousands of ways to get the dreams come true or a thousand ways to make it happen but if you don't want to do something for your future there are also a thousand reasons not to do it so kung sa tagalog pa kung ayaw maraming dahilan kung gusto maraming paraan uh, that is the updated um, money on my investment as of February 12. Uh, next update is uh, when the stocks go up. I'll show you the difference. I will show you that there's no reason to be afraid of as long as your investment or your that's for your retirement and that's for like like mine is 20 to 25 years from now. So I'm not uh, really afraid and I will show you that uh, the stock market in the end will go up. So yeah and see you on my next update guys.
Hi guys! Today is the end of March. I'll just update you today. Today is end of March. And I saw that the stock market is go up. So that's why I keep you updating guys for you uh, not to be scared because the stock market will go up. Especially if that is an investment, if that is a retirement. That's okay. If that's okay to go down. Don't ever time the market guys. Don't buy um, okay, I will just wait until the stock market is so down because you don't really know what is down for the stock market and what is the up. Just keep investing to your retirement, guys. So let's go, guys. We will see together and uh, I will show you that my investment or my retirement uh, account go up right now. So I show you the, again, I show you this, guys, not to show off but to prove that there's no reason to be scared on um investing for your retirement investing your money to a stock market there's really no reason guys believe me okay i will show you guys so this is my retirement guys this is my roth ira that if you can see that that is roth ira that is my roth so that is all my investment i did not invest a lot i only invest a stock smart stock and if you can see guys as of if you can see guys as of 320 see my uh my i lost only 486 right now i think the last time is 1200 and my money right now is 10628 that is my money right now so it go up guys you will not really lose money just don't i just advise guys just don't sell your stock when it's so down that you are afraid oh it goes down like for this one i will see for this is microsoft i bought microsoft and that is i i invest microsoft as of today 4498 that is the current value but i invested 4699 and the current value is for so i lost like about 200 so i will not afraid of that one don't sell that oh i lost 200 i'm afraid i will lose everything no guys just don't touch it just leave it in there believe me it will go up okay so yeah that's how the investment world works okay so just anyway my investment and my retirement will be there for 25 years so I'll, i'm not afraid so that is for my roth ira so i will show you what happened to my roth for one day and the 401k okay so if you can see guys that is my 401k so my 401k right now is 15,400 so I think the last time I showed this to you guys is way back on December 2021 so let's we'll see what happened here So if you can see to my my Roth 401k guys, that's how much I lost guys, $855. Now my current value right now as of 318, this is 318, mm, today is already the 20th I think. The current value of my 401k and Roth 401k, this is a company sponsored retirement, it's 15000 402 so that is the current value right now this is my investment for my 401 and roth 401k this one so this is how i do mine so i put equity and stocks 13,844 and band and fixed income 1,557 so that's how i allocate my investment again this is the value of my Roth 401k and 401k together and I lost 855 as of today so don't just don't be as scared guys that's why I reason I show that to you guys because I show you that it will really go up and down as long as you will be let them stay in there for long time it's a long-term investment you don't need to be afraid there's nothing to be afraid of okay so see you on my next update guys thank you for watching and i'll show you that there's nothing to be afraid of investing in your retirement okay
it's that is just normal to go up and down but in the very end your money will go up okay thank you for watching guys see you on my next update